sacrificing an old lady for chicken. Howdy, y'all. <laughs> I have something to show you. I went to Target today and uh, listen, I don't need more mugs. I really don't. But I think you guys need to see this one and you'll understand why I needed it. <laughs> Just appreciate this. I say walk, don't, no. Run, don't walk. Or oh, maybe walk. I don't know. <laughs> Yo, I I have a whole notebook of spirit fair information. <laughs> I've been doing homework. This game is getting so complicated. <laughs> I don't even know, guys. There's so many things to do in this game. I'm taking forever. I'm so distracted. <laughs> but today I really want to try to make that fried chicken that we wouldn't that we weren't able to make last time. So in order to do that, I need to get the rock destroyer and to get the rock destroyer, I need to get like all, all, all other billion things. So I hope they ask for pork at some point because I sure have a lot of that. I need to get that rock destroyer, which means I need to get a fire glow because that's one of the ingredients I need for that and a lot of money and other things. So there's going to be a lot of perusing around the map today. <laughs> Ring the bell. Oh, you know, I will. You know I will for you, Andy. But one thing I did realize is that we do need a spirit flower. And I think we might need to say goodbye to Alice. Because it's the only one that I'm close to getting that spirit flower from. I don't think I'm ready. I really don't want to do it. Okay. I'm gonna go... Where am I gonna go? Is the question. I'm gonna try to get some fire seats from the fireflies is what i'm trying to do oh this is a new event we've never had this before do you hear that stella is that music an organ strings how incredibly steering how dark and mysterious oh what beauty stella will you mind letting the music in it would mean so much to me hmm that the music strikes straight to your heart oh god oh my god there's so many oh why is there a red one Oh, that's the one with the seeds. Time I'm gonna be ready. Oh, God, kind of ready. I need to plant those fire seeds. One thing we need to do to complete Alice's requests is to build this orchard. Wow, this is so pretty. I'm gonna plant things for her already so that when she wakes up, there's stuff in the orchard. <laughs> Where is she? Come on, Alice, wake up. Oh, Stella, you've built an orchard and it looks almost exactly like the one my husband built. Oh my God, it's so pretty. I love the lights on the top. So cozy and magical. We planted our first apple tree along with the birth of our first daughter. You should plant a tree for yourself. I already planted a girl. Wait, wait ahead of you. Oh, listen to me rambling again. Okay, I'm gonna try to get some aluminum. I think we're gonna have to face the aluminum dragon. We need some aluminium or aluminum, whatever you say. There we go. Almost. So I got the aluminum. I got the fire glows. I just need the spirit flower. Where's Alice? Alice, what else do you need? Where is she? Oh my gosh, she's so cute sleeping in her little bead. My thoughts are overheating. This tree, Stella, it grew so quickly. I know you'll be able to build some great memories here. Stella, I've been doing some thinking all my life. I've had to take care of others. Cooking, cleaning, taking care of the children. I thought if it's not too much of a hassle, of course, and since we're traveling all over all the time, well, maybe you could come on a little trip with me. Yes, let's go, girl's trip. Let's go to Nordweiler. From what I've heard, it sounds just like my Swedish romance novel. Let's go take Alice on an adventure. I'll do it. I'll literally die for you, my friend. Which one is Nord Nordweiler? Oh, there it is. Where am I? Literally, where am I? Oh, I'm here. Okay. Let me use this one. Oh, Stella, thank you so much for bringing me here. I feel like a young girl again. I can't wait to see all the sights. Let's go, friend. Come on, hurry up. Hurry up, little lady. Is that an ancient wooden elevator cage? Oh, why does it feel like Alice never goes out? <laughs> Honestly, me. I'm like, are those trees? Oh, I don't want to get rid of Alice. I can't believe they're making us do this. It's by climbing one of these that Angstar managed to get away from Harold's gang. From her book, that's so cute. Oh, and this statue here. Bushes ever white. 
just as I picture it. How uncanny. There's really not much to look at in this island. I don't know why Alice wanted to come to this one in particular. But hey, I'll go behind you, girl. Whatever you want to do. This place. Oh, and this dark, windy spot. Listen, Alice, I love you. But I really don't need to know the entire plot of the book. Ouch. Oh, what? Stella, no, I'm alright, thank you. I'm just a little tired. Oh no. Let's get back home, okay? Just let's go. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm already crying. <laughs> so sad. I mean, I know the old age is normal, but I don't know. <laughs> Would you mind helping an old lady walk back to the tender? Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. The way she says hello to the people. A minute, Stella. I wanted to have a word with you. Hmm. We had some fun together with the trip and all, but I can keep following you around like that, huh? It's just too tiring. Girl, I was following you around. Has anybody told you how smothering you can be? Oh, Ma'am. <laughs> what? Grandma's gotta go. <laughs> it's the lead poisoning. That's why summer is best spirit. Honestly, I miss summer every day. Here. Questionable meal. <laughs> I've baked something for the crew. I let you distribute it. Oh, cute. Finally, somebody made some food in this place. Slay Alice. Here. Have some pie. Uh -huh. You might have noticed, but Alice, well, she seems to have some trouble getting around, doesn't she? I don't think she can use the ladders uh -huh. anymore. Alice is getting old. This is so sad. Maybe you can move her house down to the deck level. Yeah, of course I'll do that. Oh, poor Alice. Oh, hello, it's you. Have you seen Eugene? When you see him, can you ask him to bring me my old wooly? It's getting a bit chilly in here. Maybe we should get moving towards the ever door, maybe? I just get a feeling that it's, it's gonna happen soon. I don't know. Oh my god, again with the fried chicken. I'm trying. I'm literally killing Alice so that I can get you damn fried chicken. Things we've been doing for that fried chicken. This game truly zero out of ten from me. <laughs> Just kidding. It's a beautiful, beautiful game. It tests you. So what you're saying is we're sacrificing an old lady for chicken. That is exactly what I'm saying. My old legs won't carry me anymore. Could you perhaps help me get to the pro? <laughs> You okay, friend? Or just, can I just go to bed? Actually, can I just go to sleep? Once my daughter Annie and I had a little outing to the seaside, it was such a oh. nice day. There was a picture of that day in the envelope you found the other day. Look at her outfit, always so fashionable. Later that day, she lost her hat to a gust of wind though. Oh, are you ready to walk me back home? Mm. Let's walk you back home, viejita. And I can wear the outfit. I'm trying to get into her house, but she's in the way. Let me put on that outfit that they gave me. I feel like these mustard trousers are not given what- are just really not given what needed to be gave, you know what I'm saying? Oh, there we go. Annie's beach outfit. I think it's very interesting in our current society how, like, we're so in denial about aging that it almost seems like such a foreign thing when we do see people age, it just- it's like something that we can almost not comprehend. And even people when they're aging, it's like they can't comprehend it either. Not me getting deep at 9... 9.18 p.m. on a Sunday night. <laughs> Annie, there you are. I was scared. I thought that you had left. Oh, she thinks I'm the daughter. We're on our way home, aren't we? Hmm, what do you mean on our way home? Oh... Home as in the Everdoor? Okay. I'll take you. Oh my god, this is so sad, y'all. <laughs> okay, we're here. Mm, Alright, let's go. Oh. God damn it, I didn't want to say goodbye to Alice. I wanted to keep her forever. What a wonderful scenery. Did you find this place all by yourself, Annie? Oh, she keeps calling us Annie. I can't. Always such an adventurer, you. I'm so proud of you. These trees are quite marvelous. Eugene will be so mad to have missed that. You haven't told me about school recently. Is everything still going well? And your grades, are they dot dot dot? Oh, of course, you graduated a long time ago. I'm sorry. I don't know how I got this confused. You're, you're not Annie, are you? Yes, of course. 
This is so sad. This one is the saddest one yet, I feel like. They just keep getting sadder and sadder, guys. When you see your father, tell him about the trees, won't you? I'm sure he'll be excited to come with us next year. Oh my god, that's so cute! Alright, so we, 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 <laughs> we, we did it! <sighs> Getting the spirit flowers is the part that always gets me. I don't know why. Just going into their bedroom again and all that stuff, I don't know. It's so sad. <laughs> well, we did it! We said goodbye to Alice from for some stupid fried chicken <laughs> i think it's funny that last stream we were literally laughing at pepperoni la slapping up pizza on pizza and this stream we're talking about growing old <laughs> and, <laughs> and grappling with the idea of death <laughs> Alrighty, have some rest have some water i love you bye y'all <laughs>